you do have to get out. And uh, State Insurance Commissioner Jim Donilon joining us here in studio. And you know, this is a time that people are thinking about insurance, mm -hmm, you know? Indeed. Um, let's talk about name storm deductible. What do people need to know about that? Very important and still largely not known by the public. Although everybody, ha almost everyone has a homeowner's policy mm -hmm. in that policy. And the legislature even required companies to put it on a separate line in larger print if there is a name storm deductible. Almost every homeowner's policy comes with one. Some are called name storm, some are called hurricane, some mm -hmm. are called wind and hail. The weather service this morning classified Barry as a hurricane, mm -hmm. category one. But if it's not a hurricane when it does damage to your house, then it may be that it would be not covered by a hurricane mm -hmm. deductible. It would fall back down to the all perils deductible of typically $1,000 or so. But for a name storm deductible, typically two to 3%, not of your damage, but of the insured value of your property, $150,000 home, 3% name storm deductible, you're out of pocket $4,500 mm -hmm. before your coverage kicks in to repair your roof that got damaged by wind or a tree limb that fell on it. Not the same with flood insurance. Flood insurance is an all perils deductible. Mm -hmm. So it's a 500 or $1,000. So, but be mindful of that, be prepared to come out of your pocket uh, with that. Mm -hmm. There are probably, sadly, so many people who will be having to file claims because of this storm. What should they be doing like right now, perhaps if they're in an area where the storm hasn't hit just yet, uh, just for insurance purposes, what should they be doing? Whether today? they've even, even if they've already been hit, mm -hmm. they should walk through their home. Okay. Hopefully it hasn't been hit and they can, with their cell phone, document what they had in place undamaged before the flood waters came in or the roof went off and the water, the rainwater came in. Let me make that point. Mm -hmm. Rainwater driven by wind is covered by your homeowner's policy. Mm -hmm. Rising water from an overtopping levee or storm surge or street flooding is excluded. Then you need a flood policy. In 2016, when Lafayette was inundated with those flood waters, only 12% of the residents had flood insurance in place. Today, it's about twice that, about 24%. That's the statewide average. And truthfully, frankly, it ought to be two or three times, times more than yeah, that. Yeah. It's a really important and, and worthwhile expenditure of money for any property owner anywhere in the state of Louisiana. But go through your home, document what you had, flat screen TV, furnishings, carpeting, et cetera. And the next step, make readily available the contact information for your agent or your company if you buy through an 800 number to start the claims process if you have a loss as a result of this event, sooner rather than later. And the reason for that is, the sooner you make your claim, get your claim number, the sooner you'll get an adjuster assigned to your claim. Mm -hmm. The sooner you'll get your money mm -hmm. from that adjuster. With that money, you can then go get a local, reputable, business, Better Business Bureau approved, uh, uh, approved uh, contractor, contractor's license, local insurance agency to document that that, that uh, uh, contractor has insurance. These events, whether it's earthquakes in California, uh, tornadoes in, in Oklahoma, or hurricanes in Louisiana, attract fraudsters, right. fly-by-night guys that follow those storms, prey on the elderly and, and victims of those events, get their big check that they just got from the insurance company, and head out of town and it is prevalent, it happens all the time, and, and it happens because those folks are anxious to get their property put back together, mm -hmm. and there are no contractors available in the local community. So the sooner, the better. Take pictures, contact, have the contact information. If you have a loss, get in touch with your company. Also know you have a duty in your flood policy or your homeowner's policy to minimize your damage, mm -hmm. so that if flood waters come in, it's your duty to tear out the, the carpeting and, yeah. and keep your expense receipts for getting help to, to do that for you mm -hmm. if you can't do it yourself. And lastly, this is the very beginning of the hurricane season. Right. One and a half months into it, three, four and a half months, three and a half months to left go. to go. Mm -hmm. Four and a half. Um, know, know that by law, the homeowners insurers can only apply one name storm deductible per season to your, oh, to your okay. claims. So if you have a claim this time, A, it won't affect your premiums. Do not hesitate to make, make a, a claim. claim. 
either flood or homeowners. And number two, if, they, if you do have a claim and it is subject to a name storm deductible, you will not have a second name storm deductible mm -hmm. this season once you reach that $4,000 or $5,000 level. Okay. Lots and lots of information there. Mm -hmm. It's very confusing. We have folks at the ready, 800-259-5300, who have all of that information. Our website has it, ldi.la.gov, 800-259-5300. Some good resources there. Hey, we can't let you leave the desk before asking you how your drive-in was today. Yeah, right? you've, been, you've been a few places uh, along how's your storm South experience? Louisiana. We were down to 31 miles to empty at Lobdell exit, okay. and um, it was, Had to fuel it up was there, blowing huh? sideways. I just saw the wind gust in Baton Rouge. Mm -hmm. yeah. They're real. It, it was is. 50, 60 mile an hour winds Oof. with rain sideways that almost discouraged me from coming, <laughs> coming over. Coming to Lafayette? But, <laughs> but I'm here and I'm glad to be. So you're heading back to Baton Rouge now? Yes. With safe travels. Thank yeah. you so much. Thank you so much really for that information. really appreciate the opportunity to share this information with your viewers. Well, you've answered That's so many questions, good. I'm sure, for a lot of people well, at you. home who are some having to deal with there. lots of things. Thank so thank you so All much right. for being good. with us.